Sorry, go ahead. Oh, Whitney's calling. I was gonna. Hey, girl. <laughs> oh. Hey. hey! Oh, we're good with. I'm at a podcast. Oh, hey, Liz. Yeah, we're girls that they've been supporting us. We're coming back. So, here. Well, like, he wants come. social media followers. How? I don't know. Like, uh, before they discover band this come for me, I'm not here to talk okay, about it. Okay, okay, I'll say it. Then. Yeah. So, 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 did the guys think that Scott was there? Was just as, trying to as a as a career move and not necessarily there to find. Yeah, but not like yeah, a lot of people were there for that. But I feel like they taught because again, I had close relationship with the boys. I think they maybe taught that he was using me right. until like Casa after Casa okay. Okay. and to get with someone. Okay. That's what I think they must have thought it was. How okay. did you feel like 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 when you were with him? Did you feel that he genuinely liked you? Did you feel that you and him had a connection before Casa? Like, how did you feel? Yeah, I did feel that. I feel like we we're definitely building towards it all because we kind of got through our like our hiccups kind mm. of thing. Um, and I did feel that. Mm. Um, I did feel we weren't in the same level as someone like Ty and Ella or right. like Justin. But we were getting to a point where, you know, we we're just going to be on highs kind of thing. Mm. And then obviously, yeah. So what were the things? Because I know when you got into Casa Amor, you said that what did you say? You, you said something like, um, I think Elon was being very attentive and he was being very expressive. At yeah. A point. You know, he would make you um, breakfast, give you coffee and all this kind of stuff. And I think you said that, you know, that you felt that Scott wasn't showing you that he liked you in the same way. So is it that Scott's way of expressing himself was different to Elon? Or yeah, definitely. That, definitely. Okay. Like, honestly, people have different ways of expressing themselves yeah. and that's okay, you yeah. know? We've talked about a lot of languages as well in the villa mm. and like, I knew it, but it wasn't like anything against him. Mm. It was just more of like, will he get, will he get there or right. whatever? But it was fine because again, I'm a chill person. Yeah. I'm not, I'm not intense. So like, I'm not that person that expects you to be like that with me 24 mm. seven. Mm. Um, so it's not like I wasn't rushing him. I never wanted to, you know, I wanted us to be naturally. Like if we're going to get there, I want there to be, it to be naturally, yeah. you know, natural. Sorry. So what are your love languages? My love languages. So there's five. Um, I would say quality time, mm. acts of services, mm. um, gifting. <laughs> <laughs> Always. <laughs> <laughs> yeah okay oh that's nice all right that that, that makes sense then because mm. it looked like ellen was being very attentive mm. yeah you, and you would have received that well okay yeah so what was it about ellen then what was it about him that made you honestly think, okay. it was just because he was a good guy at her mm. like the first night he was like you know you know I, it wasn't the second night because the first night we were literally slapped like this well <laughs> the second night he was like oh let's pray together like it was just very said, let's oh, pray yeah ah! Yeah. Hello. Then, is he Yoruba? Where's he from? Where's Ghana? Oh, he's Ghana. Oh. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Hey. So it was for me. It's just like, oh, like you know, he's a nice guy. Do you know what I mean? Like he's a nice guy. Like I, you know, when someone's doing that, I can't be like, oh, f you. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like I couldn't. And that's a Nigerian girl. Doesn't yeah. Matter. Let's pray. Yeah. It's gonna yeah. be like, oh. like you can't be like, no. Do yeah. you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> like, you're the devil. Like, <laughs> like wow. do you know what I mean? So it was just stuff like that. Yeah. That like you know. I was just like, oh, you know what? He's nice at heart. Do you yeah. know what I mean? Like, let me just, you know, open and see if it could be a potential mm. anything. Like, let me, yeah. So were you actually attracted to any of the guys in Casa? Casa? Yeah. If you had to, if you had to list three of your top. There wasn't three of my top. <laughs> okay, two. <laughs> Maybe two. <laughs> um, oh, Casa was hard yeah. because, again, we all went in there and we, all had to like get there. like with the boys someone else had that natural hit off that's why a lot of the girls were like oh, like you know mm. you know this is gonna be a long three days yeah, yeah 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 it was feeling very and like we had to like we didn't really have a choice of who we had to talk to as well mm. what was easy like oh you oh you said you didn't have a choice in who you wanted to talk to like that now huh? so how does that work like Wait, what we had to share a bed with the guy who we spoke who spoke to us the first time so like we didn't really get to like explore as much oh. we didn't get to like uzi as well was another one that you know he wanted to talk to leah katie and ella but he had talked to ella 
Do you know what I mean? Oh. Yeah. So it was very like intense. And that's what I'm saying. You guys don't understand how intense Casa yeah. was. Like it was very, very intense. Like mm -hmm. and very stuff. So so even when you're not filming in the villa, because there's bad weather as well. So when the bad weather is there, we weren't outside. Sorry, when the bad weather is there, we weren't outside filming. Right. So it cut our time even more. Oh, so then when yeah. we are filming, we're filming for that hour and they're focusing on different conversations, blah, 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 this, mm -hmm. that. Then after that, stop. Girls with girls, boys mm -hmm. with boys. And you know, we got to, and you can't talk Love Island. Mm -hmm. So it was very like, it was just very intense yeah. in Casa. Yeah. Very yeah. intense. What was Uzi like? Uzi was nice. Yeah. Very quiet, very chill. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so he came across like he that. Came across yeah, that he is that. Gentle. But on the outside, Uzi is so different. Really? Yeah, he's wow. so much more. I literally said to him at the final screen party, I was like, I like Uzi outside. Yeah. <laughs> but I just feel like in that, like, everyone's so much better on the outside yeah. than they are on the inside. Because you feel like you, you've kind of molded yourself to fit into that situation. Right. And like, you know, certain things, you've kind of filtered yourself as well. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like, we definitely filtered ourselves. You For know, sure. certain things that you want to say, you can't say. Mm -hmm. Certain yeah. things you want to address, you can't address. Certain things that you have to bite your tongue, you have to bite your tongue. So mm -hmm. in that house, you were really filtered. Mm -hmm. um, not because they tell you to, but just because you know, you know. you're, you're on TV. You're mindful, tips, exactly, yeah. exactly. Like even I think there was one time when they were like, they came and they were like, oh, we can't use words like chocolate and vanilla to describe men. And <laughs> oh, <gosh. laughs> like, you know, so we all kind of had to just adapt. Mm -hmm. you yeah. know? Even Zach at the start was like, oh, if this was outside, I'd be saying this. Like, you know, he was really mad at me. Like, yeah. <laughs> do you know what I mean?